shoe's coming off. His shoe's coming off. Go. Happy New Year! We're the Three Musketeers. And today we're doing a special challenge to celebrate. And remember to follow our YouTube channel if you want to see what the lives of Shane dancers are like. Let's go! Competing, we have Team Try Hard with Sam as the leader. And over here, we have Team Party Hat with CC as the leader. And one more thing, the losing team will have to face a grueling consequence. Oh my gosh. And to judge, we've invited two special guests, Diana and Lin Jie. Before we begin, Sam, what's your team's biggest strength? And why are you gonna win? Okay, our biggest strength is that we're very creative and we're like chopsticks together, okay? We're unbreakable. High five! Yes! yes. What are you guys most worried about for this challenge? <laughs> sure not <laughs> we're not worried. We're not worried. They got it. The first challenge, the ethnic folk dance challenge. So each team prepared an ethnic or folk dance for the other team to learn. You have five minutes to learn it and you have three members representing your team. Us three will judge. Whichever team does it better gets a point. Let's begin. Let's review our decisions. Three, two, one. The lead dancer is really important. I really like Daoyong in the front. She's not just doing moves, she's dancing, actually dancing. Enjoy it. I'll be honest though, I was pretty surprised that you guys made it like that. Um, you guys did a bit better than I imagined, but not good enough. Sorry. We tried hard. <laughs> the reason why I gave it to Team Party Hats is mostly because they were more together, movements wise, and yes. yeah, synchronized. And for the gentlemen, we forgot movements. That's my biggest problem. <laughs> Basic. Sam, what are you doing for your team? Look at Kim, he's trying so hard. The reason I'm able to yawn is because I know Kim has this in the bag, okay? No problem. I'm gonna take a quick nap while he gets it. Reveal. Oh! For this round, it's a you guys get one point each. The draw. Oh, it's a yeah. draw. Okay, so total tally is one to one, and we'll give a little bit of an explanation for why we chose. Well, I'm sorry, girls, but I guess my expectation is pretty high, so did reach my expectation? Because last one you. Did really was really good. Well, 
You guys still impressed me with your ability to do the style of the movements correctly. The reason why I chose Team Try Hard was because, in my opinion, their choreography was harder. And the second is that Ji Sung's <laughs> dancing feeling was really, really good Smelling for this dance. the dance. So I had to give to them. But the girls did really well too. The second challenge is the technical move combo. So what you have to do is perform any technical move that you can do consecutively, okay? And you'll select two team members to represent your team. Their time is combined, and whoever does it for the longest wins. So it's gonna be time-based. We got our two competitors here. What's your strategy? Explain. Okay, my strategy is just uh, win, okay? Slow <laughs> and steady, and then think and about the just happy moments. And then just happy moments? <laughs> what are you talking about? Just try hard, <laughs> slow and steady wins the race. Come on, guys, we got this. Ready? Three, two, one, go! Dude. That's so <laughs> Oh my. <laughs> Getting <laughs> Okay, it's been It's been 30 seconds. Oh my god. 30 seconds. 35 seconds. Stop! 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 Oh my god, that's pretty um, intense. One second. Guys was 53 seconds and girls were 58, but what movement were you doing? Dandy or? Okay, so I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to take 10 seconds off because the rule was you have to do the same movement the whole time. So we're gonna take 10 seconds off of the girls' time right now. So there are 48 seconds and guys are 53. 53. 53. Three, two, one, start. Hard, His movement is, this movement requires a lot of stamina. She's kind of going off position right now. <laughs> that needs coordination, man. You can try it. She's not in the same position oh, anymore. No. His shoe's coming off. His shoe's coming off. Oh no, oh no! Stop! 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 lasted about 148. 148. And the girls, actually, when Megan stumbled on the side, I already stopped them, sorry. Oh. So the girls are about 139, okay? So 10 second difference. This round goes to the boys then. Try hard. So right now the total score is two to one. All right, these challenges are very, very tough. They might look easy to our viewers, but they're actually very difficult to perform. And to do that many, it was very impressive. So good job to both teams. Challenge number three is the flexibility endurance challenge. So we've selected three flexibility movements which you have to perform. The first one is zi jing guan, also known as the needle. You have to hold it for the longest time, okay? And you'll be going head to head at the same time. The second round is the front leg hold on a yoga block. And the third movement is the side leg hold while blindfolded. Okay, best two out of three wins a point. Good luck, guys. Flexibility challenge is actually really hard for guys, but we have a superstar here. So no worries, okay, we got this. Don't, Don't forget, forget to like, comment, and subscribe. subscribe. If you like bubble tea. Yeah, he's a bubble tea guy. Matthew, are you nervous? I'm very nervous, actually, because they, they're, they're all uh, <laughs> Okay, ready? Three. Two, one, go. Wow. Oh my gosh. We 
have Hannah here and Matthew. So you're in a hurry. Well, you better calm down. We're all friends around you. Just join the fun. So this takes a lot of flexibility and, and strength. strength as well. Endurance. And it's actually very impressive for a guy to you know, do the needle. All right, all right. <laughs> Too scared to talk to distracted team members. Oh my goodness! So, Hannah, back here. Find your balance back. Find your balance back. He's recovering. He's recovering. Matthew just might be able to do it. Our only requirement is that you hold your leg. Oh no, Matthew's struggling. Right now, you're probably feeling a little bit numb. Yeah. It's been more than a minute, by the way, so good job. Oh my gosh, this is really sad. Matthew has good endurance. It's hard because Hannah's actually straight the whole time. Yeah. Alright, Maddie. One hand. You're down, you're down, okay. you're down. You're down. Try this at home. Please don't try this at <laughs> home. Don't try this at home. Good job, Hannah. Good job. Now we're gonna do front leg hold. Ready? Three, two, one, go. <gasps> Straighten your legs. The way he's standing is blocked. It's not very smart. You're gonna do it very strategically. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? Kind of fun. <laughs> it's been 35 seconds. Oh yeah, he's like using his arm strength for sure. Yeah. Look at the way he's pitched forward right now. Guys, you do a practice. Girls, get up. The girls placed the block like this. The guy was like this, okay? It's two out of three already, so Team Party Hats gets a point. So it's gonna be tied 2-2. Two -two. Right now, we're doing the third round as a bonus. No pressure. Just for fun. He's doing so much for our team. Good job. Not no, my best. Okay. It's okay. Three, two, one, start. This is actually a lot harder than it looks. Usually without blind blindfolds, they would just be standing still. But when you close your eyes, it feels completely different. He's already <laughs> facing And our baby panda is already facing the wrong direction. He's disoriented. <laughs> okay, you guys can come down. Three, two, one. There's no points needed here. Now, we are going to take a short break from our challenges. And we are in New York City. And we're gonna visit some of the theaters we performed in before, starting with Lincoln Center. We're at Lincoln Center right now, and I first performed here in 2010. And also reminded me that I actually started performing with Shin Yun in 2007. And going into 2022, I've been with the company dancing for 15 years. This brings back a lot of memories because a lot of the performers who I was working with at the time in 2010, they're not dancing anymore. And even for myself, I'm actually more focused on teaching right now, even though I'm still performing with the company. So it just brings back a lot of memories and especially the good and the bad, right? That comes together. Throughout these 15 years, we've been through a lot of tough times. 
and especially as a dancer, you go through a lot of hardship, you have to take a lot of pain. But even though it wasn't easy, it was still a really great experience. And going into 2022, I want to remind myself that regardless of if things, you know, are good or bad, I have the choice myself to choose whether to be grateful and happy about my situation. So that's just reminding myself. And I'm also happy to be here with my friend today, Sam and Jisung. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, it's just that right now, you know, things are a little bit uncertain sometimes, but we still have a lot to be thankful for. Like, you know, with our friends and family, just to be here, it's actually a really amazing experience, so. Exactly. Yep. <laughs>